Well, since the recession began, the Council of Governments has looked at ways to prevent foreclosures in the region. It formed the Capital Area Foreclosure Network to give community service coordinators and borrowers a resource to combat the crisis. Today, COG's Board of Directors discussed the findings and recommendations from two reports on regional housing challenges. The housing market is definitely rebounding. It's rebounding all over the country and including uh, in this area. And uh, we've seen some of the greatest improvements in the region in Prince George's County. So, you know, median sales prices uh, in Prince George's County are seeing double digit gains, you know, in 2014 compared to 2013. Uh, but there's still uh, some pockets. Um, out there that are issues, and particularly in Prince George's County, we're still seeing um, high delinquency rates. So the Capital Area Foreclosure Network was created in 2009 to respond to the foreclosure crisis, and we know that the housing market has changed significantly since then. Um, the funding landscape of funders that are able to support the work of housing counselors has also changed significantly with Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac um, ending their grant making. Um, so we recognize that it's really important to continue supporting housing counselors and the work is really still necessary, especially in Prince George's County and other areas of our region that were hard hit. Including Housing security in the Washington region is the first report on a jurisdictional basis to examine affordable housing needs, including homelessness and home ownership.